Good day, Auckland. I'm Petru Janse van Vieren calling you from sunny Johannesburg in South Africa. I am a PhD program coordinator and researcher at Drama for Life at the Wits University. And I'm Christian Freisleben calling from Linz from Austria and I'm freelancing as teacher, as journalist and I'm also working at the University of Applied Sciences in St. Pölten, a small town in Austria and doing a lot of improv together with the fantastic Pedro. Yes, and um, we want to catch some flying pigs with you as impossible it might, as it might feel. Uh, so we are going to share with you about the flying pig that our PhD students here at Drama for Life face. So PhD for anybody in any country is a difficult and noteworthy thing, but for our students it can be even more difficult. Just to connect with their supervisors, they have to face unstable internet, power outages, often uh, very expensive Wi-Fi and data, but perhaps most of all the tyranny of distance. Because their fieldwork happened in Nigeria among refugee children, or perhaps in Zimbabwe with survivors of HIV and AIDS, or in the rural areas of South Africa working with environmental education. And so they don't all meet face to face. And for them attaining a PhD can be like catching a flying pig. Yes, and there are also a lot of facilitators working with people around the world and they want to help them to find their flying pigs in different areas of life, in business, in healthcare, in social welfare. And we are trying to help people to search, find and foster their flying pigs, also using online sessions. And we will together present our findings of doing online journeys together with flying pig catchers. And we have a presentation for you on Saturday at 11 about our findings. Yes, and on Sunday we're doing a workshop where you can experience the online embodiment processes. The same processes that we use to draw the PhD cohort together and help them face their flying pigs. So maybe you have a flying pig that you would like to come and play with. We'll yes, see you again. And, and we cho join us at 11.30 on Sunday. So see you there. <laughs>